What's up guys? Hey, back in Grand Teton National Park. So obviously was here uh, with my family, but now I am back this time for a school trip and super psyched about it because totally different experience this time. I'm gonna be paddling in some kayaks and doing some like more primitive camping. So super, super excited about it, but it's getting late. It's after nine o'clock. We just pulled up to, to camp and we got everything all set up. Uh, I've got some new gear that I'm uh, testing out on this trip that I'm really excited about, including this tent, uh, which is the Black Diamond Highlight. But I'm not going to film anything else tonight. Just wanted to uh, let you guys know where I'm at. And then when we get out on the boats tomorrow and out, out on the lake, uh, we'll do some more filming and show you guys that. But thanks so much for joining me. Well, we're getting loaded up, putting in here at String Lake. I'm going to make our way up to Lee Lake. So kind of a different experience getting boats loaded up, but it's sweet, super cool. Decided to get out and do some paddling. All right, we're on the water. Getting everybody else launched behind me there. Ooh, baby. Getting choked a little bit by my jacket, but got a big long boat. This is awesome. Super, super cool. Excited to be out here. This is awesome. Such a cool way to experience a, a park be out on the lake like this, all the gear loaded up in a kayak, so cool. Well, so there's six of us that are out here uh, on this trip. It's a little bit smaller class. And uh, our original plan was to put in at Jenny Lake, but that uh, ended up not working out because apparently you can't get to String Lake from Jenny Lake. So put in here at String Lake, like I said before, and uh, we're gonna make our way up to Lee Lake where we will camp for two nights, which would be nice, so we don't have to worry about picking up camp and loading up kayaks for the second time to move to move camps, but I'm excited to spend a lot of time on the water. I mean, look at the mountains behind me. What is this? This is incredible. Yeah, I cannot believe how pretty it is. This water is so clear. No, but I paddled over and there was like a group of geese okay. over there. So cool. Just like making their way into the water. This is just absolutely fantastic. Dude, look at the grand. How cool is that? The thing just like is so phenomenally fascinating to me how jagged and just awesome awesome that peak is you finding some fish So Lee Lake drains, has this little creek that runs through. Well, we're at the point where we're 
getting out of String Lake and making the portage up to Lee Lake so that we can then paddle to our camp. But that was beautiful. I don't think it's possible to not find something beautiful here. Boats are heavy. <laughs> but I love this view. I think this is so cool with the boats. Yeah. Yeah, that's really cool. From there? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so cool every time. <laughs> All right, now we're out on Lee Lake. Stop to eat some lunch at the portage. This lake is way, way bigger. It's about a mile and a half to camp. Yeah, about a mile and a half to camp from this point. So, what we're gonna wanna do is get your skirt on. So it's quite windy getting to camp. There's a lot of wind coming down Paintbrush Canyon. And uh, <laughs> it's a little exciting. I don't have a lot of boat experience. And so, uh, it's got my heart rate up quite a bit, but yeah, pretty cool. I don't know how well you can see that, but all that wind coming down, I just came over here close to the shore, but there's the other three. We got two, two of the other students up in front of me, but yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of exciting. Battling the wind is not all it's cracked up to be, but this is a cool, cool experience. This is exciting. Pretty big white caps for what I'm used to. Obviously it's not gonna be anything compared to what a lot of people experience, but yeah, this is exciting. Woo! Paintbrush Canyon is where we're camping tonight. And tomorrow night. <laughs> This is so cool. Devin, just looking up there at those mountains on the sun, man, that's so cool. Dude, it is incredible. That was a lot of effort and a lot of work. Ah, <laughs> uh, but so rewarding. Man, packing's cool. going out to look around camp a little bit. So, so pretty up here. You got this beautiful stream running next to camp going into the lake. It's pretty awesome. Got cold though, like significantly cold. Probably in the 40s-ish. Can you see that big, huge bug bite I got? Like a mosquito bite right under my eye? Ooh. Ooh. Oh well, it's part of the fun. But this is Paintbrush Canyon behind me. That's where we're uh, staying tonight and the next night. So this is Camp 16 here on Lee Lake. Really, really pretty area. So it's kind of funny, we all have our own tent. There's six of us on this, like six tents set up on this little tiny uh, camp area. But 
We got six boats, six tents, just having a great, great time. It's absolutely beautiful. I'll walk over and I'll show you camp a little bit, but yeah, that bug bite. What in the world? You see Tent City in there. Pretty amazing view. <laughs> All the boats. It's really windy and cold right now. It's starting to rain. Here it comes. <laughs> that is cool. I know, I was like, this is going to be If you can see it, but rain. I'm just so cool. Tree hiding. <laughs> Tree hugging. Oh, it's keeping me dry. <laughs> Scott's tent's not even wet. Here we go. I got deemed to uh, follow what is being called Waglandia. So back here is the bear box. And there's also a pole to hang. <laughs> Porter is gonna hang his wag bag. Oh, this is heavy. <laughs> Ode to Waglandia. Very nice. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> is that high enough to keep the bear away? <laughs> I don't think the bear is gonna want to get. I don't know. When he's got access to this. If he wants it that bad, he can. Compared to that, I think he's going to want to get into that. That just happened. <laughs> Did we decide what the. Waglandia? What Waglandia. The, what the, the wave is? or? Yes. Oh, yeah. it's, it's four fingers. <laughs> on your right on, butt on cheek. On your right butt cheek, and you look up at a 45 degree angle. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Well, we've resorted to the tents because lots of rain. It's about 7.30 right now, maybe getting close to 8 o'clock, so it's just been a fantastic day. Really, really cool day. But the view from my tent right now is incredible. Just so awesome. Just looking out right on the lake. Man, it's a rough life. Well, here's the deal. It's been raining for several hours now. Just hanging out in the tent. It's about 9.30. And, uh... <laughs> this is definitely the ultimate test for me for this tent. It's got the new... Not new, but new for me. Black Diamond Highlight. And, uh... Yeah. It's doing okay. My seam seal job uh, is definitely working, but I can feel a little bit of condensation uh, as the walls are saturating. But it's hard to complain in a beautiful place and uh, just really, really loving it. Still just raining super hard. I'm in my Korea outdoor products thermo down, 15 degree quilt, and uh, it's been pretty warm and impressive so far. I've got the foot box all like tightened up to keep uh, my feet nice and warm, and yeah, the loft on it's 
been really nice. Um, I did get a little bit wet, so it's like kind of like really humid in here right now, but yeah, it's actually kind of fantastic. stopped. Beautiful morning. It's about 6.30 in the morning right now. Just got done eating breakfast and now we're gonna go paddle. We're gonna head out in that way, right in front of me. We'll uh, do some exploring before the weather turns because it's still a little sketchy today. You can see that, but it's pretty nice. It's cold though, probably 40s. Yeah, something like that. But I'm seriously loving this tent. Helps that there's a nice view. All right, back out on the water. We're just gonna paddle around for fun today since we're staying in the same place tonight. But what a beautiful place. I have said that so many times already, but right now the mountain in front of me, just absolutely breathtaking. This is unreal. Clouds are moving in down real low over the over the peaks. So expecting some weather today, so that should be kind of exciting. I mean, we had a crazy amount of rain last night, um, but this lake is really, really pretty. This is just one of the, the cooler experiences that I've ever had. So we're gonna go paddle and just have a good time today. So kind. <laughs> paddle, paddle, paddle. There's an island out here that we're gonna go snake around. But there's Paintbrush Canyon right behind me, right behind my head. down to go look at some other lakes. So we obviously got out of the boats because we're walking. <laughs> <laughs> not sure which lake this is. It might be Trapper Lake or Bear Pot Lake. Not totally sure, but wow, it's pretty. <laughs>
windy and choppy and awesome. We literally just launched a few minutes ago and just as I launched into the water, a bald eagle flew like 10 feet above us, just like hovering straight above us. Holy cow, that was so, so cool. I've seen him before, like a lot in the wild, but not like that. That was a really, really neat experience. Just so, so cool. So we're paddling against the wind again. Back to camp. Oh yeah. Feeling a lot more confident in the, in the boat today than I was yesterday. But uh, not trying to get too ahead of myself because this is not the kind of situation where you'd want to flip in any way because this water is really cold. So just uh, trying to be smart and safe and take it easy. Woo baby! We're out hiking up from above camp to find some waterfalls. That is so cool. That is incredible. Oh my god. Totally bushwhacking. Get up to see this. Enormous waterfall. <laughs> oh, my word. Wow. This waterfall is coming out of Paintbrush Canyon. Also raining. <laughs> no, like, anyways, but she, but she said that lady would never. She's like, I never. Hey, Devin, what you cooking? Do my maid. Tacos. Because she just always <laughs> tacos. Guy, you know, or can I help you? Just very professional, but she didn't want. To. Ooh, baby. so incredibly peaceful right now. So quiet. This is, I just don't even have words for 
how awesome it is to just experience this right now. So quiet. We're the only people on the lake. Rain's falling. Yeah. This is what it's about. It doesn't even matter. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. Sort of being done. Back on string lake now. It's a little bit of a current. It's almost like a slow moving river on this lake. It's a pretty quick paddle. But this has been one of the better trips I've been on in a while for school. <clears throat> Just a really, really neat experience. A bunch of good people. And a different way to get out into the backcountry than just hiking with a backpack. Tons and tons of fun. Well guys, that's it. We are back to the takeout. Time to load up the car and head home. Oh, amazing. I am just so, so blown away at how awesome that trip was. Such a good time. As always, thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hope you guys have an awesome day.